You've got to be making everything easy for other people as well as yourself. It's not just about efficiency for you. It's efficiency for other people, your customers, your partners, the people that enable what you do. I don't just ask people to be a referrer for me as a business. I ask people to be a referrer and then tell them what my clients, ideal clients are seeing before they meet me. What are the sort of things that they're doing? What are the sort of things they're seeing? Who are they? And I educate my partners on who I'm looking for. It's easy. I don't just expect them to know who my ideal client's going to be. And I make sure they've got a record of that so they can refer back to it. And then I tell them what they can say to refer me in to people they know. Here's what you send in an email, roughly. Tailor it. Here's what you send in a WhatsApp. Here's what you'd send in a, an email. Here's how you'd approach it in person, or I'd approach it in person. Tailor it to what you think. And hands on heart, a lot of that has come by Dave Plunkett. So big shout out, Dave. Your partnerships course, Kick-Ass Collaboration Program, is fantastic. It is the bee's knees. I thought I knew a lot of this stuff already. And it turns out I was fucking wrong. So Dave's telling me all the, all the different materials that I need to create. And my mind's thinking, how do I automate getting these out to my partners so that I don't have to sit and do this because I will forget or I'll not do it. How do I make things easy for people, not just myself? So I think that is really powerful. And it's something everybody should be considering this day and age. We talk about chat GPT and AI, right? That's only part of it, only a small part of it. If you, you, right, so if you write the same text over and over again, why are you writing that text over and over again? Use a tool like Briskine or TextBlaze or something similar to, you know, you write a short code and it tab and it, and it outputs all that paragraph for you because you use it all the time. Or if you've got a link that you use all the time, here's my diary. Don't have that link stored somewhere. You've got to go find it, copy it and paste it into the document. Just have it as a short code in your text document, in your text platform. So I might type um, Cal, C-A-L, and it, and it'll input into LinkedIn or into email or wherever I'm writing, it'll input my calendar link. And I might have different calendar links for different meeting types. And on my desk, all I might have is the short codes for them just till I get used to doing them. I've used them for that long now. I know what they all are. Beautiful, saves me a ton of time. My goal, all right, so I only work four days a week, four days. And I don't mean morning till night. Right, that's, that doesn't work for me. I've got a six-year-old at home and I've got a six-month-old. That doesn't work for me. My family wouldn't survive that. And what's the point in me having revenue if I'm not able to spend it with my family because they're buggered off because I work all hours. 